Thanks to those who watched our broadcast this afternoon of the UW Lacrosse Eagles and the UW Eau Claire Blue Golds. But if you didn't catch the game, that's okay. We have the highlights. Lacrosse going for win number eight on the year. This is the 88th meeting between the two of the west side on the state. And Eau Claire looking for their first win in lacrosse since 2013. Coming out hot. The first play of the game, a play action. And Harry Rubidoux finds an open Joe Swanson 67 yards. And the Eagles don't know what hit them. It's 7 nothing Blue Golds, but the Eagles will respond with who else but Joey Stutzman. The 1,000 yard rusher takes it in from 19 yards out. Stutzman had 135 yards today, but Eau Claire hangs in there. Rubidoux, he's going to take it himself. You're completely fooling the defense. They get back the lead but they can't hang on to it. Cade Garcia getting the start at quarterback with an injured Jacob Parks, and he finds Jack Studer. UWL goes into half with a six-point lead, and in the second half, they explode. Backside fade, it's Studer again. Eagles take a 13-point lead, and then it's basically the same play on the other side, this time to Cam Sorensen. Cade Garcia now made the most of his first career start, 260 yards and four touchdowns. Eagles finish the regular season. Season yeah, eight and two. We we're pretty excited with the way we came out at halftime, able to finish that. I thought they had a good game plan for us, uh, especially early on. Uh, you know, with some of our, our Tampa defense that we, that we run on defense, they were able to kind of hit the backside seam of that. Excited with the way that, that we finished that game and, and took care of what we need to take care of. You no, know, we just have great team chemistry. I think that's the biggest thing with this group is I just feel super close with all these guys, and I think that's what makes this special is just the relationships we have and you know selling out for each other and just doing whatever it takes to win. You know, I think we had the expectations of, of being where we are, but you know, when you know it goes by quick, and, and now that we're here, you know, it's a, it's a great feeling. It's uh, it's awesome. Tomorrow, the Eagles will learn their fate when it comes to the postseason. This is the Eagles' first eight-win season since 2017.